So, um, <clears throat> I might have started that video a little bit too early, but anyway, um, you can see here, uh, I'm gonna explain how I wired this, okay? So the capacitor, the brown is gonna be the capacitor wires, okay? And this one's gonna be our common. Common's gonna go in this case to L2, okay? If you can see that, it goes to L2. I don't know why they put the the uh, bl black and gray, the b b high and medium, they put it on the unused, and then they put the low on the accessory. So I'm gonna believe that this thing was actually running on low this whole time. But um, that's that's besides the point. Um, I put it back on heating and cooling for high, medium, high, and high, the third and fourth speed on cool and heat. And that actually goes directly to the motor through this uh, hole here. So this one actually goes through here to the motor on, on the side. And um, everything's wired up. I already zip tied everything here, as you can see. Um, when I get up to here, though, this is, this is the tricky part. Um, so if this is common, white is always going to be common. And white is coming from, in this case, L2. So default, this means this is both L1. So that is just something to keep in mind. Um, uh, quickly explain this. The Basically what happens is that when you call for heating or cooling, either the blue or the black is engaged. Okay, so it's gonna be hot, one or the other. And that's going to call for the, the, the correct speed on the blower. This one, um, <clears throat> has a wireless thermostat that's connected to this common. Um, it's off, but that's what's happening here is this is connected to a common via a thermostat that's actually Wi-Fi. I, I don't like these and it's like whatever at this point. Um, everything's good now. Um, I tested it already and it, it does run. So I'm gonna put the cover back on and then um, we're gonna see if we can start this up and then uh, hopefully everything is all good. On to the next video.